Hi everybody, welcome to a new video. My name is Marylise and I am your favorite manifestation mama. And if you are new here, I make videos on manifestation and the law of assumption. So be sure to hit that subscribe button and like the video. Today, of course, we're gonna be talking more about the law of assumption. And what is the law of assumption? I wanted to make some new content for people that might not know what exactly the law of assumption even is or have never heard of it. Um, a lot of people like myself um, have heard of the law of attraction um, and have followed that. I have followed the law of attraction for many, many years, ever since the book, um, The Secret, the book in the movie, The Secret came out. And so I was literally obsessed with um, that content for years and years until I stumbled upon the law of assumption and it just made so much more sense and you get your manifestation faster and easier. So what is it? The law of assumption is a philosophy that was proposed by Neville Goddard. And if you don't know who he is, go ahead and Google him. Again, his name is Neville Goddard, G-O-D-D-A-R-D. And I always hashtag him in my videos because he is a manifestation baddie, okay? So what we assume to be true, we call into our reality. So think about it, guys. Whether or not you realize it, um, you're always using the law of assumption. Like when you get into your car um, in the morning and you turn on the car with your keys, you are assuming that car is going to start, that a car is going to take you where you want to go from A to B, right? If you pull into the gas station, you go to pump your gas. You're assuming that you have money or money in your ATM to pay for the gas. You're assuming that the gas is going to come out of the gas pump. You're assuming everything um, throughout your day, basically. So why not use that to your full advantage in your life? Um, a lot of people just don't are just not aware of it or something. Um, and so with the law of assumption, we hold the power. We are the power and energy source to our lives and to our manifesting. Um, I personally strongly believe in God. I have always believed in God. I grew up going to church. Um, I've always prayed. I have always known from the bottom of my heart that there is a God or a higher power source that has created all of this, all of us. Um, but I also know that I have a power source too. Um, I am a power source and I have always known that we are all just a part of this same like huge picture um, here on earth. We're all bits and pieces of just the same big picture is all how, how I've like always felt about it. And so um, with that being said, the human mind is completely lim limitless because if you think about it, we have, you know, God or this energy inside of us all. And we have this um, ability to be able to manifest anything or create anything we want with our lives. And um, why not use that to our advantage? Why not create the things that we want instead of what we don't want? So... That is basically how the law of assumption works and like what our, the philosophy is behind that. And then in the next um, couple videos, I'm going to get into like how to manifest um, and how to do things step by step. But I wanted to start here. And if there's any questions, you can always drop them in the comments. I would love to um, get back to you. And if you um would like to please feel free to share this video and make sure to like it and please subscribe to my page for more content all right i hope you're all having a wonderful friday have a great day and thank you as always for watching